What's up, guys? Welcome back to The Garage. Gerald here with you. And of course, if there's a new horror trailer, it's floating around in my mind to sit down and not only watch it, but react to it in real time for you guys. So yesterday, a new trailer dropped for The First Omen, which is a prequel to the 1976 classic, The Omen. Of course, directed by Richard Donner. This is the Donner Cut. It's one of those movies that came along when there was a renaissance of religious horror with, of course, the success of The Exorcist a few years earlier, Rosemary's Baby. Speaking of The Exorcist, with what David Gordon Green just did with The Exorcist Believer, it has me nervous. It has me weary. So my question is, are they just using the IP? Are they just using the title The Omen and hoping that people show up because of the longevity of that type of film and really of that franchise and that original Donner film. I'm going to stop speculating. I'm not going to hate on this too early. Let's watch it together and then I will <laughs> bash it if need be or tell you what I think about it at the end. And play... Backwards. Bill Nighy. To control those who don't believe. Ooh. Create something to fear. don't have to be afraid. This child is his way. One second. I'm going to backtrack a little bit here. I actually really, really dug that. That was a really good teaser. It didn't show too much. I don't know what the hell's going on. In the first The Omen from 76, the child, Damien, is born of a woman and an animal. I think it was like a jack, like a wild jackal or something like that. And so it's not of this world. Now, this is a prequel to that. So some scenes there in that trailer, I mean, are they going to show the jackal giving birth to Damien? Guys, what's going on? My mind is, this trailer also did something really fascinating because it makes me want to go back and watch the original now after just seeing that trailer, which is kind of crazy. Um, I'm really excited for this after that. I think they're trying to make a genuinely scary film. I don't think they're, like I said in the beginning, I was concerned about them just using the name and trying to do make money off of it, basically. But I do see a genuine horror, like religious horror movie in there that could be original, it could be great. The young actress, Nell Tiger Free, who was creepy AF, but also kind of sexy in Servant, the M. Night Shyamalan series on Apple TV. She was also on Game of Thrones. She's an up-and-comer, and there was some, like, kind of... Similar stuff going on in this trailer. A lot of sexual things. She was licking the dude's face. She looked like she was kind of maybe dressed up as a stripper in one scene in front of a mirror, which is weird because I think she's a nun or training to be a nun. I, I don't know. I, I will just tell you I'm excited. I'm going to go rewatch it right now because that was actually a lot better than I thought it would be. It was not a surface level use of IP. I feel like that's an original. It looks very original and it has me very excited. The brooding music, the imagery... They had that one scene of her on the bed with, uh, I think it was a spider crawling on her face. So she was channeling her Jim Carrey cable guy there. That's what made me that. That's what that made me think of as I was watching it. Guys, what did you think about the trailer for the first Omen coming out in April? Are you excited for this horror movie? Or are you going to check it out? Let me know down in the comments. What did you think of the trailer? I'll see you guys next time in the garage.